2016 Jayco White Top Model 27 DSRL. The commonality of the Jayco is an integrated tongue going straight into the I beam frame, protective diamond plate up front, lighted power tongue jack, you got twin 30 pound bottles of propane. Nice feature here LED accents on your one piece front cap, very resembling a, a fifth wheel. Virtually takes the lamination out of the equation, pretty nice. You got power stabilizer jacks in all four corners. You're going to notice a outside drink refrigerator here in the pass-through storage compartment that's called the chillin' store. You also have a portable uh, gas grill that mounts to the bumper of this particular camper. Vacuum bonded sidewalls, roofs, floors, magnum truss roof system on the roof which is rated for 4,500 pounds. If you don't believe me, go to YouTube. They stack 4,500 pounds of cinder blocks on top of this. Tried that with one of the competition. Half of the weight, half of the weight. Awning will self bail if it gets too much rain in there. If you forget to leave your awning open, it starts to rain, you don't have to worry about it. It'll tilt to one side or the other. Also notice the LED light strip up there. Pretty special. You've got a mount for your television that we're gonna see once we go inside the camper. You can watch TV outside, very cool. Outside Fury and Marine Grade speakers holds up to the elements. Of course, you got your furnace, easy access to your refrigerator. You got the, um, the vent for your range hood hot water heater. Also notice the axles on this. Those are called wide tracker axles. Much smoother ride, easier to pull. A lot of the, um, the weight of the appliances inside the kitchen are actually on the axle, so you don't have a lot of tongue weight. You don't have a lot of sway with uh, the weight in the, in the rear of the camper. You come around this side, you're going to notice an entry assist handle. It's very easy to get into and out of the camper. This comes with a glacier package, enclosed underbelly, heated holding tanks, Zero degrees outside, 78 degrees inside, 100 degree outside, a comfortable 68 degrees inside. Walking around the outside, you're going to see a mount where the, bump, uh, the bumper mounted grill goes. That's pretty cool. You're out here cooking hamburgers, hot dogs, whatever you want. Jacob's gone to the frameless windows on this particular model. Um, super lightweight aluminum frame with fiberglass sided. Spare tire, roof ladder. You want to get up there once a year, inspect the uh, the situation with the caulk around the air conditioner vents, the skylights, and the fans and whatnot. Not only does Jayco vacuum bond the sidewalls, floors, and roofs, they also vacuum bond the side of the slides. It keeps your AC in, keeps your furnace in, it's just a much better R value. Walking around this way. You have an outside hot and cold shower right here. That's pretty handy. Wash the dog, wash the cat if you want, wash your feet off. You also have a city water connection and a black water tank flush. Keeps your black water tank nice and clean. More storage, easy access to the Plumtex um, piping water system has. Just another place Jacob found storage and threw it out there for you. This is just simply the other side of the pass-through storage. Jayco's one of the only manufacturers that I'm aware of that actually runs their vinyl flooring all the way from the front of the camper to the rear. They don't cut around there. You don't need cord around or anything like that. Pretty nice, nice little dock like here, LEDs. Let's go on inside. This is a perfect Entertain 6 Feed 4 Sleep 2 camper. Perfect for two people with an occasional overnight guest. Double door access, look how low that bottom stair is. Very easy to get up to. My knees are a little bad. I'm able to get up there, no problem. First thing you're gonna notice is the blonde interior. Yes, these are recliners. And this is a rear living room floor plan, so the recliners are actually facing the entertainment center, which consists of the Furion flat screen TV. Then you also have your CD, your DVD, your MP3 entertainment system right there. But just looking around, a wonderful sofa sleeper for your overnight guests. Freestanding dinette. They even put storage underneath the chairs there. Kind of special. It just has a really nice rich coloration to it. Um, you notice the Amish handcrafted cabinetry throughout. You have drawers down here. Notice they're full extension. They also have ball bearing roller glides that are uh, rated at 75 pounds. Very solid. Lots of kitchen countertops. Sink cover, it's a big sink. 
microwave, three burner cooktop, nice oven, five setting adjustable Norcold refrigerator and freezer. They have a lip right here in case your ice cream melts. You don't open up the camper and find it running down the side of your fridge. Thermostatically controlled, wall mounted air conditioner. It's ducted, the ducts are insulated. 15,000 BTU AC up on the roof. You're going to notice the bathroom now. It's got a full on walk in shower that's glass, mirrored medicine cabinet with a nice vanity, porcelain toilet. Nice skylight for those people who are a little bit taller than me. And then right into the master bedroom, you got a nice walk around clean bed. There's storage underneath. You got his and her shirt closets on both sides of the bed. You're also going to notice that you have outlets on both sides as well. Alarm clock, sleep apnea machine, anything like that. Jacob thought about it. Jacob brought it. This is Ocean Grove RV, folks. I'm Frank. We're located at the corner of US 1, State Road 206. We've been here 37 years. Come see this, Jim.